Now, elevating your style shouldn't be a difficult, arduous process involving buying a lot of clothes and going through a lot of trial and error. In today's video, guys, I'm going to be showing you five simple ways on how to elevate any outfit. And the great thing here is you can use all these tips in the exact same outfit. Let's get into it. Number one is some basic clothing care and maintenance and that involves steaming and lint rolling. It's gonna be very hard for your outfits to look their absolute best when each individual item could use a little bit of TLC. If you're gonna be wearing any heavier materials like wool and cottons, they tend to be lint magnets. So a $2 brush from the dollar store that you can find is going to do wonders for these heavier materials to keep them looking presentable as possible. And if you like a little bit looser, more breathable clothing, like a lot of linens, they tend to wrinkle like crazy. If you wanna get the best look and most out of them, you're gonna definitely need to steam it. So like a $40 steamer you can pick up on Amazon can do wonders. Taking that little bit of additional time to make sure each item is clean, fresh, and presentable as possible is gonna do wonders for your outfits, especially when it comes to pairing it with the next things on this list. Number two is the rule of thirds, which is basically just proportions. Maintaining good proportions in your outfit is a key way to uh, elevate it. Basically, the rule of thirds say that things look more aesthetically pleasing when they're placed in one third or two thirds proportions. Now, if you see somebody wearing, you know, an outfit that pretty much cuts the body in half, it makes the torso look longer and your legs look shorter. Anatomically speaking, your legs are longer than your torso and you want to maintain these proportions. And a very simple rule that I like to follow for anything for shirts, sweaters, button downs, if it goes past that top third of your fly, you tuck it in. Just tuck it in so it doesn't make your torso look super long and shorten up your legs. And when you do this, you're maintaining good balance and proportions between your upper body and your lower body. Now, when it comes to layering with jackets, coats, blazers, you get a pass when it comes to just a lot of the formality when it comes to suits, but overcoats should be that two thirds length. So it should be two thirds of your height or stopping just right underneath your kneecap. Anything else like a leather jacket should again stop at that one third of that fly. Now, a lot of times finding stuff off the rack, especially for shorter coats and jackets can be extremely difficult if you're a guy under six foot because the majority of stuff off the rack will fit guys that are around six one to about six two well in terms of maintaining that one third proportion. But keep this in mind for trying to elevate your outfits. Number three is white pants. And this is an absolute hack because whatever you plan on pairing with them is going to look great as long as you maintain good proportions. And I like the reverse contrast that it creates because from if you take a typical like outfit, like a pair of trousers and a plain t-shirt, it would always be like a dark pair of pants and a light colored shirt. But reversing that, it just creates a bit different contrast. And I actually find I'm a much bigger fan of this just because you don't see guys wearing it too often. It also creates great proportions and the elongation of the legs and whatever you plan on wearing with it is going to look absolutely amazing so whether you're going with uh, lighter tones darker tones earth tones pastels whatever color item that you pick wearing on top is going to look that much better and if you plan on layering maintain those one third proportions it looks absolutely great and you kind of get this old money preppy ivy league style going without trying too hard number four is an old style rule and that is every outfit should have at least five to eight points of interest basically things that you can look at in the outfit that complement it and look pretty well this is style rules this is in human anatomy and physiology it's not that complicated but even if we take a very basic outfit with three items so i'm gonna go with a white pair of pants a polo shirt and a pair of loafers nothing too fancy here we have three points of interest here the loafers the pants the polo shirt now let's start elevating. I'm gonna go throw on a braided belt here. That's gonna add a point of interest. I can throw on a watch, a pair of glasses, and a bracelet. That can add more points to it. But even if you wanna go with less accessories, using something like a braided belt instead of a leather belt, that texture there adds a second point 
of interest there is these little subtle details that you can add into your outfits without overdoing it can really elevate a basic three item combination into something a little bit more number five is heavily underrated and i recommend you guys give it a shot and that is to add some texture into your outfits this is a simple way that you can pretty much elevate any basics and essentials that you like to wear for example, if you like blazers like myself, which I'm getting back into some sartorial wear, instead of having these plain cotton and satin options, maybe go with something wool. It adds a nice little texture. They always have this like fine pattern to it that can really elevate a casual suit that you're trying to wear. Something with polo shirts for the summertime, if you're used to wearing just cotton polo shirts, maybe something knit could be a great option. Or in the wintertime, maybe instead of a turtleneck sweater, you go with a cable knit sweater just to add a little bit of dimension and more points of interest to an outfit that can really make it stand apart while being pretty simple and straightforward. It's really elevating those basics and essentials pieces that you can really see how far you can take your style and elevate a very plain and simple fit. And there you guys have it, five simple things that you can do to elevate any outfit. If you guys made it this far into the video, be sure to drop a like and hit that subscribe button because you watch this far, you're way more serious about dressing better, looking better, and ultimately being better. Thank you all so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Peace.